All right. So tonight we're gonna make some burger, get down on all of our trim. And it's a carnivore, actually it's a 42. So it's got a big throat. To give you an example, the throat on here is like this big for it. We use, uh, we use this for all of our trim. Everybody asks like, when you're making jerky, well, what do you do with everything? Well, officially it's called trim. So what we do, this is one of the things that we do with it. Um, besides making pepperoni sticks, burger, what we're doing right now, right? the list goes on and on. But tonight, this is what we're doing with all of our trim after we saved up on it. So, well, I'll give you guys like a little short little tutorial of it. One of the things is, even though it has a, like a pretty big throat, not like the commercial one that I was showing you guys earlier, but this one's still at home. This this carnivore is from Cavella's. Uh, spent like $750 on it. It actually has different uh, sizes to it, but I always run the bigger one first so it doesn't get jammed so much. And then if you want to run it through again, make it finer, you can use a smaller one so it doesn't. But the sinew, the fat, everything will get clogged up. So I always run bigger things so it can just go through, straight through without having any complications, which is eventually after we spend about an hour running it. It also has a cold pack for the neck, but we're not gonna run it that long to where it's gonna heat. If it does, then I just shut it off. So tonight we're gonna get started on running some burger real quick like. This is all the trim too, so. Make sure it's tight. So you're already gonna know it's already running bigger, so that's what I'm talking about, the, the length of it. The width of it, not the length. And then I already have pre-cut everything, so it should just spit out. A lot of people like to use uh, fat. Don't, oh yeah, by the way, I got asked about using elk fat to make burgers. Do not do that. No good. Chow shuck, it's no good at all, don't do it. You have all this stuff at the roof of your mouth. All the elk fat, and it's just like horrible. It's like, don't do it. Um, you use bacon or something. I know everybody has their remedies and whatnot, so. But don't use the fat. I tried it too, so I know what I'm talking about. It's no good. So all the calves that we pull off, that's what we're doing too. But you can keep running it over and over to, to make, and use the smaller ones. Uh, this thing's a beast, by the way. They get grind down, like it gets geared down on it. So we have several tubs, like a lot of tubs that we will use, so once one fills up, then we start on another one. But if you're doing a lot, like this is multiple elk for a lot of trim, I'd say this is what you're going to go for. Don't use those small ones. The gears are grind down and won't handle it. I mean, this is serious burger making. This is in like 
doing a couple of pads. This would be like a lot. And it goes from what? Yeah. You're gonna have a hard time keeping up on feeding it too. It's like it will grow. So I just always move it around to the corners. close to being filled up, but I'll still keep trying to pack it up. And here's the calves that I've always cut off. We'll put that in there too. Then you want to rerun that a couple times too, of course. But it's everything, like, burger's the best. Yeah, taco night every night. Indian taco. See, literally, I'm dumping everything in there right now. It's starting to get hot, so. And I said that when it gets hot, I don't have the pick pack on it, but. So I'll give you guys an example of how much burger we make. The, use the big one first, and then go to smaller. Make it more fun. And then we're gonna call this good because we're gonna have to bag these up in gallon bags or whatnot. So my friend that wants these ones, so. We'll get it done up for him. I'm gonna turn it off because it's starting to get hot. So then there you go, got all your burger. Just in like a couple minutes. You got it all hammered out. So alright, see you guys later.